Hey guys, I just got my Vine Market box. I've never ordered from them before and I saw somebody else say something about it. They actually had a um, code where I got 20% off my first order. So the total was supposed to be $107.56 and I actually only paid $87.56. So I'm going to show you what I got. Um, I just opened the box and it looks like this, which is... It's huge, it's a ton of stuff, and it was free shipping also, so we're definitely going to do this again. We actually have 10% off everything for the next two months as well, so definitely going to be using them again, I think. Uh, the prices were really good. So I'm going to go through and tell you how much I ended up paying for each thing. So I've never tried these before. They're called Super Cookies. I got them for Nathan. Um... They're just blueberry vanilla. Very few ingredients. I can't. Let's see. Mm -mm. These were $4.99. I ended up paying $4.06. And it comes with six servings of their serving sizes. So that wasn't bad. I got some hemp seeds, which we hadn't had in forever. Let me see what I ended up paying for those. They were supposed to be $9.39 and I paid $7.64. That's a great price for hemp seeds. Um, so this is a big bag and it's all the way full. Never tried these before and oh, they are kind of all broken. So that's kind of annoying. Um, I guess buying chips on there is not a good deal because they feel pretty broken. But I've never tried these before. They're Luke's Organic Cha Cha Chai Seed. Um, I don't think I would recommend getting chips on there because those are broken. Let's see, they were $4.49. I ended up paying $3.66. I got some red quinoa. I'm going to try using this when we make our quinoa pizza. Never had red quinoa. But let's see, quinoa. Quinoa, 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 quinoa. where are you? Oh, they don't even have the quinoa on here. So I can't tell you how much I paid for this. I don't see that on here. Oh, there it is. Ultra Ego Red Quinoa. $8.39, I paid $6.83, which is a really good price for this size bag because I have this at um, the grocery store. I think it's $9. This is Purely Elizabeth Ancient Grain Hot Cereal. It's just six organic grains. We've never tried that before either. Um, I think that's a pretty good price for the amount. Let me see. $7.49 and I paid $6.10. So $6.10 for that. Oh, these chips are broken too. Uh -huh. That is a bummer. It actually looks like it, it kind of got open somewhere because there's no air left in there. Well, I'm definitely not going to order chips on there again. I don't think it's their fault. I just had so many other stuff that I think that kind of mess it up, but anyways, this is a pretty big box, bag of late July chai and quinoa. This was the only kind I could find that didn't use um, canola oil, so let's see, those are late July. I paid $4.31 for this big bag, but they are broken. Um, let's see. Oh, coconut oil. It's in like a super crazy package. But this I got for $11 for a 23 ounce thing of coconut oil um, after the sale. So that was a good price. Oh my god, these are all broken too. That is pretty annoying. Like everything is broken. Um, I got these Go Raw chocolate granola. Let's see. What did I pay for those? These were supposed to be $10.49 and I paid $8.54. Um, I don't remember if that's a good price, but it's only got a few ingredients. It is a pretty big bag, but as you can see, see that was broken too. So I guess we'll have to use it as cereal now instead of really vanilla. I got a big bag of organic Thompson raisins. Woodstock. Um, let's see, Woodstock raisins, raisins, raisins. They're supposed to be $5.99. I got those for $4.88. Let's 
Um, this is purely Elizabeth. Again, these ones aren't broken. This is ancient green granola with quinoa, amaranth, and chai seeds. So, let's see, what did I pay for those? Six ten. they were supposed to be seven forty nine. I got these Cascadian Farm Honey Roasted Nut Bars. We've never tried these before, but these were the only ones that didn't have ingredients that I would have been not okay with. They were $4.06, normally $4.99. Um, I got Nathaniel these goat milk yogurt pouches. Um, they're not organic, but they are um, GMO free and it is goat milk, so goats are not as highly um, antibiotic and stuff like cows are. So I thought they would be good for him. Um, I don't know what I paid for them. Let's see. They were $15.99 and I paid $13.02. So good price. Then I've got another box here. I've got to open. So let's see. Whoa. Um, I think they uh, made a mistake here because they sent me like five million of these. Hold on, let me see. These are made in nature. Made in nature drive. Yeah, I, I don't think. Because <laughs> this is supposed to be uh, made in nature organic pitted plums. They're $5.19 and I paid $4.22. But they sent me like five million of them. So I don't, <laughs> I don't know what happened with that. Maybe it came with that many, and I just didn't realize. But four twenty-two for this many bags, it's crazy. Okay, and then let's see what else we got here. Blast. Oh, this is a bag of chips too. In a in a box, so maybe these ones didn't get broken, I don't know, oh, here we go, oh, this is kind of a smaller bag, um, they feel like they're pretty well together, these are also Luke's Organic Kale Multigrain um, Seed Chips. And those were $3.65. They're supposed to be $4.49. So I definitely would not recommend buying chips through them. Um, these ones are okay, but the other ones are broken pretty bad. Um, not that it's their fault. It's just I wouldn't recommend buying chips. Even granola kind of got ruined. But some of the granola was okay. So I guess it's hit or miss. Um, yeah. But... You can go on their website right now. I'm not being paid for this at all. I just happened upon it on my own, and they don't know that I'm making this video or anything. They haven't paid me. They're not, they didn't give me any of this stuff for free. Um, I paid my own money, but right now they are doing a code. It's try us 20 and you get 20% off your whole order. And then for the next two months, you get 10% off anytime you order. So it's an awesome deal. They have a ton of organic non-GMO stuff. They don't really have any cold stuff from what I was looking at. Don't quote me on it because I didn't look very thoroughly. I just bought some stuff that we either regularly buy or stuff that I wanted to try because it had um, ingredients that I felt comfortable feeding Nathaniel. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. If you try them, thumbs up. If you've used them before and you like them, thumbs up. If you'd like more haul videos like unboxing like this, let me know. Thank you guys for watching. Bye!